Hello and welcome to WePC. My name is Jay and today I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot problems with your middle mouse button. The middle mouse button is often overlooked and underappreciated, but without it, we'd be unable to scroll while gaming or working. Firstly, try disconnecting and reconnecting your mouse. It may seem obvious, but this quick fix will often solve your problem. Once you have done this, reconnect it to the same computer and see if your problem is fixed. And if not, try using another computer or laptop. If connecting to another computer or laptop doesn't solve your problem, it could be an issue with the hardware. But before returning your mouse to the manufacturer, try these next steps first. Our first fix is within Windows Hardware Troubleshooter, and here's how to do it. Type Control Panel into your Windows search bar and press Enter. Open Hardware and Sound, then open Devices and Printers. Locate your mouse, right-click the icon and select Troubleshoot. Now hopefully this has solved your problems, but if not, try our second fix and update your mouse driver. Now, a lot of mouses are plug and play and don't require a driver. However, for those that do, follow these simple steps to update them. Go to your preferred search engine, type in the name of your mouse, followed by the word Drivers. Go to the mouse manufacturer's page, download the latest driver software, run the installer, and then finally restart your computer for the changes to take effect. If updating the mouse driver still hasn't fixed the problem, our last fix is to change your registry settings. Don't worry, it's not as difficult as it sounds. Follow these simple steps and we'll teach you how to do so. Type registry editor into your Windows search bar and open the registry. Your computer will ask for permission to make changes. Simply click yes. Double click H key current user, the second folder on the list, then control panel, then desktop, and in the desktop folder, Scroll down until you find wheel scroll lines. It's in alphabetical order to make it easier. Simply right click it and then click on modify and make sure the value data is set to free. If this final fix still does not solve your problem, the problem is most likely with the mouse hardware. If the mouse is still under warranty, then get in touch with the retailer you bought it from or if it's no longer under warranty, you could try getting in touch with the mouse manufacturer to see if you can get it repaired or even replaced. Alternatively, if your mouse is in need of an update, you can take a look at the article down there in the description to see our tried and tested best gaming mice of 2020 to help you choose a new one. If you've had this problem before, or maybe you've even got a different fix that wasn't mentioned in this video, then leave us a comment. As always, we would love if you could leave a like on the video, subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit the notification bell so you never miss an upload, and we'll see you in the next one.